Hello dear friends, this is Dr. Mahmoud Aminul Islam. Welcome to my channel. In my previous videos, I explained various aspects of adsorption thermodynamics. These videos have been very popular. Therefore, in this video, I will explain how to calculate equilibrium constant Kc in adsorption thermodynamic correctly and easily. This video is very important, so please do not skip. Well, the main equation for thermodynamic parameters is the Gibbs free energy change, which is del G naught equal to minus RT ln Kc where del G is the Gibbs free energy change, R is the universal gas constant, T is the temperature in Kelvin. If we consider the unit of universal gas constant R, which is 8.314 joule per Kelvin per mole, while the unit for temperature is Kelvin. Therefore, the unit for the term RT is joule per mole, while the SI unit for del G naught is joule per mole. If del G naught is joule per mole and RT is also joule per mole, therefore the equilibrium constant Kc must be dimensionless, that is a parameter without any unit. This discussion is consistent with International Union of Pure and Applied Chemists, IOPAC assumption. However, inaccurate application of the equilibrium constant can lead to incorrect estimation of the thermodynamic parameters and vice versa. Now, So, the correct values of the dimensionless Kc can be obtained by multiplying 1000 gram per liter for C in milligram per liter and Q in milligram per gram since the solution density is approximately 1000 gram per liter or 1 gram per liter. However, if your concentration is mole per liter, then you need to uh, multiply 55.5 to this equation uh, Kc equal to QE divided by C into 1000. So this is the correct form for the Kc values. If your unit of concentration is milligram per liter and Q is milligram per gram. Therefore, based on previous reports, Kc can be considered as the value of Langmuir constant, Fraunhofer constant, and Henry isotherm model constant. So, you can directly calculate del G value from this uh, equation. However, in order to calculate other values, for example, del G A is not and del S not, which are enthalpy chains and entropy chains, you need to plot ln Kc versus 1 by T. And from slope you can easily calculate del is not while from intercept you can easily calculate uh, entropy so this is how you can easily correctly calculate various thermodynamic parameters so these are the references from where most of the informations have been gathered in my next video i will explain 
other aspect of adsorption. If you have any questions or query, please feel free to leave comments in the comment section. That's for today. Thanks for watching. Please do visit Aminul Cam Innovation. Like, comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more videos.